Craig Harrison, another win. We keep saying that every week, but it keeps happening. Yeah, it doesn't get sick of it, you know. I don't like, you know, it's, it's something that we want to say after every game. Yeah, I thought the lads were fantastic tonight. You know, it was, we knew it was going to be a tough game. We had a game Saturday, Wednesday, Saturday again, you know, and it, on two heavy pitches. But I thought today we, we, it was one of our better performances of the season. You know, we knew it was going to be hard, we knew it was going to be physical. You know, they're very organised, they're very good at what they do, they've got some good players, you know, Andy's got a good team together there, but you know, I think overall, you know, we're we're sorry, overall we were excellent, you know, I think and we dealt with what they had to and we caused them problems as well. Just the one change on Wednesday, Scott Quigley started yeah. and your confidence in him was proved because with just one minute on the clock yeah. he scored the opening goal. Yeah, you know, the old cliche goes in football was scored at probably the two best times. A minute in and a minute, well, two or three minutes in the second half, and you know, I think theoretically that probably killed the game off. They had to come out, obviously, 1 0, they can still be patient and still chip away and get the weight for that opportunity to fall to them. But I think at 2 0, they had to come out a bit and it stretched the game. And obviously, 3 0, you know, it was a you know, it was great to score from a set piece as well. And 21 points clear in the Daffabet Wells Premier League, but not counting your chickens yet, yeah, certainly not. You know, whether. Whether we're 21, 25, 30, 9, 2, 1, behind, we want to win every game. You know, that, that's my philosophy and mentality. And I'm fortunate I've got a group of players and staff that, that have got that mentality as well. You know, I think somebody, well, a couple of people have asked lately, do you ever get sick of winning? I've never heard such a ridiculous question in my life. If you're a professional sportsman and you get sick of winning, you won't go very far. So, you know, we've got a great set of lads that want to win every single game. Due, it, it won't happen every single game. It, it's sometimes someone will take points off, it, but we want to try and win as many as we can. And the next game is Kevin Drews on yeah. Boxing Day at Park Hall. What sort of game are you expecting from them? Yeah, they're fighting for their lives. You know, they're, they're, I know they're not technically in the relegation zone. You know, but they're not far away. You know, and they need to get pick points up. You know, they obviously want to survive, and that's a different challenge in itself you know tonight we're playing against Connors Key who are second who are, who, are, who are playing to catch us and finish second in a European position you know and then Boxing Day we're playing Kevin Druids that are I think the third bottom if I'm if I'm not wrong in you know three or four points in front of Airbus but they're gonna they're gonna be fighting for their lives and you know it's always tough when you play against teams that have got a lot to play for and with a couple of games over the Christmas period, both yeah. against Druids, yeah. what's the injury situation like at the moment? Yeah, today we've obviously, you know, you look at Wes Fletcher was injured, you know, Robbie Parry's just had an operation, so he's going to be out for a while. You also look at Chris Sargent was injured, John Routledge injured as well, you know, and Jamie Mullen injured, so we've got five or six, you know, players that, that, are, that are key to her, but, you know, we'll just proved today that the strength of the squad, you know, Phil Baker has played midfield for on, on Wednesday and today and he's been excellent, you know, fantastic. You know, that other players have shuffled around and come in and, you know, it just proves the, you know, not so much the strength and depth for our squad, but the, the players that are the so-called coming in to, to, to the strength and depth, they're not the more than good enough to play in any team in the league and, you know, the more than good enough to play for us, it's just sometimes circumstances. Craig, as always, thank you for your time. And as we've said 19 times now so far this season, just in the league alone, congratulations on the win. Thank you very much.